Welcome back to Main Stage 2021. We are as we have been for the past two hours. Zane and Oscar, Tandu yes, and Lovage. We are and back. We've got more melee doubles coming up. We're trying to shepherd everything into the into the top eight. I'm going to say shepherd so many times this weekend because it's Fiction's first Shepherd's land here. tournament. But I do so feel like we are guiding our sheep to the promised land. I agree. Two melee top eight. Yeah. And the viewers as, as well. So thank you to all the viewers at home for checking out our stream today. I'm getting really excited being back on LAN. Me I'll, too. I'll, I'll tell you because I it's, really am. You know, it, coming up to it, I was like, okay, another melee tournament. Yeah. But actually seeing everybody in person again it, has been awesome. And getting to see four people sitting next to each other on a CRT. Good timing That's production. Crazy. Yeah. These are the players I was talking about. We have a top Ooh. eight qualifier coming up for you guys. But yeah, man, just this site right here at a uh, stacked. Land tournament again is just a beautiful thing to see. So this is an interesting matchup. We got Nut and Vavez, the heroes of SoCal, obviously. Okay. Who I got to commentate a little bit earlier with Hugo. And then it's JFlex and Zealot, the Crease Tab gaming crew. Uh, JFlex is in the middle with the GameCube controller. Yes. And, and, is, and Zealot is using the frame one there. Yes, that's okay. correct. Yeah, so JFlex been around for a minute. Uh, he's one of the J-Sheiks I keep hearing about. Yeah, but he's he established the J-Sheik. People need to put respect on his name. This man's been making upsets since, like, Big House 5. Uh, and then Zealot, a real up-and-comer. So it's an interesting pairing that you got there. Can you remind me who Zealot plays? Is he a Fox, Fox player? Yeah. Oh, that's right, yeah. yeah. Super sick to see this East Coast representation all the way here in Ontario, Ontario California. Yeah. And like you said, it's against Nut and Vavez, two uh, SoCal team's lovers. Mm -hmm. And here we go into game one on Battlefield. Vavez starting off with two good down smashes. Wow. That's, that's a Vavez trademark. He, he it, shows he, how good that move is. Does he let it rip? Oh, he lets it rip. I don't see him with it either. Hmm. Oh. Ooh. Nut not finding the edge guard on Zealot. Not quite, and now he's gotten reversal. It's actually both red team off stage. Oh, over a hundred, so important yeah. there. Wow. Okay. All right, a little messy, but Zealot manages to find both the stocks. Ooh, nice laser land. Yeah, I like, like the way JFlex is playing here, using the top platform. He's gonna be patient and wait for his teammate. Mm -hmm. Zealot using the P tag. I wonder what the P means, Zane. I don't know. I have no clue. Nice boost grab there by Nut. Oh, Ooh. double hit there. Oh, he sent him back to stage. He said, get back over there. And then he just... <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, Nut went for the backer that you actually don't really need to go for. Yeah. And it somehow reversed him towards center stage. JFlex, that is. That was actually really, really big. Swing. Flex is at 170%. Yeah, this is actually crazy. And now he's got a grab. Oh, playing it nice and simple here. Letting Zealot take the front line again. Let me tell you, if there's one matchup, or actually, if there are two matchups that Flex has been playing a lot of recently, it's Sheik and Peach. Because he plays Wally like every week that they show up to a Jersey tournament That's together right, in yeah. Grand Finals. And then he's just, there's so many Sheiks in New York now. Because uh, Heartstrings is in New York and Just Jason is in New York. Uh -huh. and, and so. Flex is very, very good at both of these matchups. Hey, shout out to the East Coast for keeping Peach alive. Yeah. So many good uh, East Coast Peach players. Polish, Wally, Ryo Beat, Laud. It's actually Flex. Oh, they're all East Coast now. <laughs> yeah. Vavez, though, repping SoCal. Hasn't, he has not been able to find those big down smashes he was on stock one. Ooh, no smash DI on that down air. Not quite. Ooh, not trying to down smash out of all of that, but great down air by Zealot. Okay, Flex should be dead here. Oh, no. no. Nut went for maybe the coolest thing I've ever seen. Yeah, he went <laughs> for reverse turn up throw to try yeah. and catch the up B. I and mean, it, if it hit and he forward aired, it would have been dope. It would have been so yeah, sick. Could have just rolled there. Okay, nice. Just release shield and, and get the down smash. Some people might have panicked on what to do there. Good edge guard here on Zealot, but finds the ledge. Vava is not able to cover it. Okay, this is a huge situation here. They gotta find some damage on JFlex before he just finds his way to the platforms again. Yeah, but Vavez does finally get a big down smash, but it still feels hard because Zealot has been so good at staying alive and he almost closes it out, not quite. Oh, Nut has like one more chance. Nope. Uh, all on Vavez now, one on two. Up smash. Yeah. Yep. 
Love the way J-Flex is playing this. You know, maybe a little bit more of a simple Sheik style, mm -hmm. but in, in teams, when you have a Fox that is playing his role correctly, mm -hmm. uh, J-Flex is, is doing this perfectly. He's staying by the ledge just enough to bait, uh, you know, a uh, nut in, and then Zealot is there to, to counteract on that bad position. Yeah, I always wish sometimes when we have these matchups on stream that we could see the kills afterwards because it feels like they were saying, like you said, the Fox was doing his role. He was playing his role correctly. And so yeah. you expect that most of the kills would be on the Fox just because how many grab up smash setups did we see? It was like 75% of their kills. Team SoCal here, opting for Dreamland. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's a big down smash. JFlex has lost half his stock already. Oh, Nut jumping in, though. Oh, unfortunate Vaves. He brought the forward air in, but only hit his teammate. Yeah, he was at least expecting to hit both of them there. But that throw invincibility. Oh, wow. Ooh. And JFlex just bringing the wall. That's what I was about to say. He's yeah. like a wall moving forward with those F tilts. Just he, him standing there not elf tilting is terrifying because yeah. you never know when he's just going to press the A button. Oh, wow. Tricky situation. It looked like JFlex was actually aiming for Zealot's up B yeah, there. Yeah, exactly. I, I, I could, you could feel some anticipation there that some sort of save was going to happen. Great needle there. He actually gets Zealot Ooh. back, but good coverage by Vavas. So great for Vavas to see that slightly higher angle and know he has enough time to get Forder yeah, out. exactly. That is really smart. Doesn't have to go for the down air. And just slap him out. Oh, Nut getting some good damage with up B. Staying alive. Oh, wow. What a tricky angle to deal with. Yeah. And I really thought that when Zealot had missed the edge there, it was going to be curtains for him. But that angle got him out of danger. Vavez does not find the edge guard on JFlex. That's actually yeah. kind of a big drop now that JFlex could potentially edge guard his teammate Nut. That was such an intelligent way for Flex to refresh his invincibility so that he could edge guard. Right. Good shine stalls here by Zealot. How far can he go though? Oh wow, what a JFlex did not turn that around with one needle. With one needle. That's all it took. Oh my god. That was insane. That needle could change the entire set. <laughs> yeah, it really he, could. That nut was at extremely low percent when he got the kill there. Yeah. Zealot should not be alive Zealot right now. Zealot should not be alive. And Zealot's doing a lot with this 120% right now. Good DI on dash attack. No follow-up. Oh, good. But look at Zealot here. Okay, if he didn't get tapped by that backer there, it was great positioning. Yeah. So threatening where he was positioning right there on the top platform or the side platform. Not trying to help out. Actually hits his teammate. Oh, and Ooh. Zealot, bit of an SD there. Yeah, might have just lost his jump or something. Or misjudged the hit stun. Oh, I love the way Vavez positioned himself there. Just got right in the middle of everything. Yep, and then hit down on the yellow stick. Yep. Oh, wow. JFlex actually screwed that up just a little bit by turning around uh, that Sheik. Up smash. Okay. A lot fewer grabs for Flex in this on this stage, it right. feels like. It's been a big difference maker. Oh, great shield drop fair, but Vavas is actually going to live, and Peach is horizontal recovery. Nice. Uh, yeah, great okay. standing needle. That was so smart from Flex, because you can imagine that the instinct might actually be to go for the 2v1 there. Peach takes so long to recovery. Uh -huh. But he recognized one needle was, again, going to be all it needed to close it out. Oh, I love this back air spacing. Watch out for that CC down smash. Vavas does find one eventually. Oh, and that's going to be it. Zealot is out. All on JFlex. Okay. Yeah. They almost did some crazy shit. Oh! oh no, 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 no. He looked into the future. And Nut, Nut kind of looked at Vavis like, are we popping off on that? And Vavis is like, no, we're not popping not off on all. that. That's just every day in the office. <laughs> oh, such a sick team combo for those guys. Oh, my God. 1-1 one, one here in this set. This is for top eight, by the way. Oh, when there's a team combo, it feels like they're trading blows, like there's a rhythm to it. And Nut jumped six steps ahead of the rhythm and said, catch up now, and but Vavez did. If Vavez's nair was one bit less, or one, one bit weaker, or one bit stronger. It wouldn't have worked. Yeah, if no it was one, one frame different, that oh nair does not God. combo. That was crazy. If you're JFlex and Zealot, you're just shaking that one off, and you're going into FD on game three here. This is a top eight qualifier, let's not forget. Mm -hmm. Vavez, edge guarding J Flex. 
Yeah, really easy for Sheik to get back to stage yeah. there against the down B, though. Or if the down air. If Sheik's patient, patient enough, she should be able to get back to center stage safely. Yeah. Okay, Zealot. Finds his way out. Oh, nice pick up there. That was really nice. And now they... Oh, it Phantom. Just adding on a little extra percent, oh, wow. I guess. Pretty crucial that Vava stays alive here. Ooh. And as I say that, falling up air from Zealot out of nowhere. Yeah, he put he put a no-fly zone in front of the red team there. Said my up air is going to cover all of this. Oh, wow. Crazy momentum on Nut. Uh, no follow-up on that sheet. Okay. Nut finds the forwarder on J-Flex. Oh, good ledge stalling by Zealot. There is no yeah. clipping that. Oh, Vava's, or Nut was just doing a chain grab. The bonafide true to God chain grab. Oh, wow, J-Flex went so high, he actually mm -hmm. had no landing lag by the time he that's touched the, the old, floor. That's the old Captain face roll recovery. When Griffin used to spam that all the time. It's an old one, but it works. Yeah. It still works, still checks out. Vava is fighting out of the corner there. Oh, that SDI on the drill was so good by Nut. Whoops, bit of a miscue by Nut there. Yeah, and takes a lot of damage for it. Man. So impressed by JFlex's back air spacing. He knows how to keep his stocks alive as long as possible while adding up damage. Yeah, we can see especially at percents like this. Ooh, oh, where are you going? Uh, they have team combos too. They said you did Sheesh. some cute shit last game, but watch this. But that back air spacing you mentioned, especially uh, potent when they're both at a high percent like that, you can see when they're at a low percent, Vavis is actually like trying to SDI, ASDI in and down so that he can get a down smash. Mm -hmm. But when the back air just sends you flying, it's so good. This is a really big edge guard opportunity. Okay. Good attempt by J-Flex to needle save there. Barely misses. Oh, and Vava is actually putting himself in the blender there. Yeah. Keeps Zealot knocked down, but... Whoa! Nut just rolled into the into the danger zone. Yeah, and they got smashed. Yeah, I saved his life there. Zealot wants this Sheik stock right now. Oh! Oh, oh, nice by Zealot. And up smash? Yeah. He's going to take that trade just to get, you know, a one-on-one -on -one going. So they let Vavez take the 2v1. Interesting. Yeah. Could have shared stocks. Oh, wow. <laughs> Is that it? That almost looked like a real combo. That looked true to me. Yeah. yeah that was crazy. Back here. Here we go. 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 Not going to do okay. it yet. You needed one more. <laughs> Okay. Nice. Oof. Two one here for Team East Coast. <laughs> you do keep doing the Team East Coast Team SoCal thing. <laughs> I just love making it a regional beef. <laughs> Make it a battle. Uh, I want it to be feuds. Yeah. Yeah. That's one thing with with net play. It feels like regional feuds die down. You know. Because it feels like we're all in one big pool of players now. Yeah, but exactly. Let's not forget these guys are playing at locals with each other every week. And there's always been a little bitter rivalry going back, you know, which coast is better kind of thing. And, uh, man, it's just great nowadays to see such strong players coming from across the world. Yeah, exactly. I'm actually, that's one of the reasons I am really hyped for the Smash World Tour Finals, too. It's just truly international event, finally. Melee is ramping up, man. It's a beautiful thing to see. Yeah. Oh, nut. Actually taking 82 off the bat. Yeah, and so far Zealot is just uh, making Yoshi's a playground playground right now. Finally gets shield grabbed by Nut. Nice. But this can be the difficulty of the double floaty team. It's Vavez, even if he has some free time, he can't get over the, to his teammate that quickly and help yeah. him. Even on Yoshi's, it's just a long way to run. Let's see if Vavez, yeah, tough to pick up that edge guard. Yeah, Needed really a little hard. bit of support from Nut. Peach on the ledge is not not the greatest. No. Ooh. Wow, I love the safety by Zealot. Okay, that's going to close out Flex. But can they edge guard this Fox? He's going to shine stall and wait for his teammate. Yeah, look at this. So good. So difficult to edge guard. Yeah, just so good by by Zealot with the shine stalls, and then also Flex did such a good job of making space for him. 
what a tech by Zealot. He should not be alive oh at 147 God. here. I feel like we've been saying that a lot today, but it's, some of these spaces have been living so long. That's going to finally do it. Vava is trying to find the Sheik in the air, but great air movement by JFlex. Oh, this is really big if they can do a lot to Zealot here. Okay, 64. Oh, it's still going. Oh, wait a sec. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, JFlex is going to take that forward throw. Zealot should be saving him here. Yep. Oh, I love that late backer, but yeah, JFlex finally going to lose that stock. He tied to up throw stack. Yeah. That. that was funny. Okay. Oh, Vavez is in a dangerous situation right now. Good air dodge. That's to be the difficulty with Peach is sometimes you don't have enough time to make stuff happen before the teammate comes yeah, and exactly. saves your opponent. Man, and for how long Zealot was living, he's the first one to reach his last stock. Nut and Vavis just did such a good job of putting together high damage off their openings after that. Oh, that spacing by Zealot on that back throw was incredible. Oh. Nut just going straight for ledge. Oh, okay. Good reactions by Nut. But it's still a bad position. Randall really given him a helping yeah. hand there. He has to let Vavez do all the heavy lifting here. Zealot with the perfect run and up smash. Last stock for Nut. They want flex so bad. But if they can combo the Fox too. Zealot gets hit by the needle. Oh, but Nut didn't get to the ledge. That's what he wanted. Oh no, Vavez is taking lots of damage. It's almost dead even. Watch out for JFlex. He has all this crouch cancel potential here. Big Finds grab. a grab. It's gonna kill. Yep. Oh my god, that killed? It's all on Nut! Not quite. Oh, but he has to up B now. Great air dodge. Nut fighting for his life here. Good back air. Is that damage on Flex is really important. Oh! That's gonna kill Zealot. Wait a sec. Okay, how did he get to stage? Oh, no way! He's dead! He's dead! Oh, Nut snags a game that he absolutely had no right winning there. And you can see Flex is a little mad about it. I He's would be a little, a little mad sad. too. I mean, he had that game in the bag or at least oh. continued the edge guard, but Nut grabbed the ledge one frame earlier than JFlex was expecting. Oh. We're going to game five here. <laughs> Nut is laughing so Dude. hard. <laughs> oh, great, man. Great effort in that two on one, though. That just shows the power of Sheik on a platform. Yeah, no kidding. If you approach her one too many times, you're eventually just going to get punished by a shield drop fair. Mm -mm. But man, you got to feel for JFlex in that one on one. Yeah. What an unfortunate SD. Oof. Still feels, though, like that was really Kreestab's, the team Kreestab's game to win, right? Mm -hmm. And so I'm wondering how they keep that momentum going into this next one. It's going to be their counter pick. Looks like the stage is decided here. JFlex laughing it off, though. Still in good spirits over it. God, what a ridiculous game four. If, if game that five is crazy. anything like that. Well, then we're in for a treat. Oh, big down smash by, that's 53 on Zealot already because of uh, Vavez's down smash. Vavez. Can he close out this edge guard? JFlex is there just in time. Wow. Yeah. But I think Zealot could actually live this. Yeah, I think he should. Yeah. He is, yeah. Just managed to get back to stage clean. Okay, this is going to be more difficult. You saw Flex go for the needle, but actually going for the needle is what got him nared there. Mm. Okay. Dead even in this game five right now. Vavez getting shined through Zealot and Ooh. finding a sick combo here. How did Vavez get out of that? That was yeah. really impressive. Wow. Confident shield grab by Vavez, and this is a double edge guard here. That's yep. two. That's going to do it. Wow. What a turnaround for Red Team in this game five. I cannot believe it is going this way. So good by Nut to avoid that dash attack by JFlex. Yeah, but Vavez is getting sort of messed up on the other side because Zealot has been really good when he gets a chance to open up on Peach. Just mm -hmm. let it rip. Vavez should be able to stall here. Yeah, but I'd be afraid of Zealot if I was on red team. Mm -hmm. That man has not been afraid to let the up smashes rip. Yep, there we go, and it's it's even now. What, yeah. a, what a comeback by blue team to tie things up. 
This is teams for you, man. Bleeds just barely matter. Oh, oh wow. Is he dead? He well, J-Flex is dead on that? Vavez hits his teammate. Let's see if that ends up mattering. Oh, oh wow. Zealot drops the up smash confirmed, but finds one anyway. Dead even match here. Jesus Christ. Yeah, and blue team disrespecting it. They know that an invincible Sheik on red team can stop all their plans on the ledge. Oh, here we go. Nut, good damage on J-Flex, but Zealot's right in there. Nut no, F-Tilted like four times in a row. Mm-hmm. Wow, that's the first meaningful hit Zealot has been hit by in so long. Yeah, he's been so good at staying out of trouble. Oh, oh that's, that's huge for Vavez. I, I was about to say, he's taken the ledge from you. Yeah, I'm glad that Nut recognized yep. it too. Nut unable to close out the stock on J-Flex. Oh, this no. This is all so bad. Yeah, Vavez cannot team. take any more damage here. Okay, okay, that should be a kill on Flex. Yep. yep. Okay, Zealot's gonna go and ledge stall. He gets hit by the oh, turnip. That's huge. He's dead. That was massive. Oh, this is still a dead even game though, Zane. Yup. It's oh! all. Vavez is in trouble. Okay, Vavis just is in stall. Trouble. Just stall. Just stall. This is all on Nut here. He he Nut has down. to do so much work in this last game. Oh, Vavez! Boxing his way out. Yeah. Throws him forward. Okay, Vavez taking the back line. J Flex. Four dares in! Oh! Oh, that's huge for Nut. Yeah, the uppy is so big. But Zealot is playing perfectly these last two stocks. I agree. It's just so hard to get anything meaningful started on him. They gotta deal with Zealot! I don't know if they can. Wait, Flex is in the... Oh! Hey, what a good pickup! And he made, he drops it there, but you gotta feel like... Okay. Red Team's time in this world is limited. It oh, might be! Zealot! Okay, dude. So scary, dude, that dash dance. Wow. What a great set. Good stuff to J Flex and Zealot representing the East Coast. Taking that in game five. I thought Nut might pull another one on two I, there. I thought so too, but Zealot, he put it, he overclocked in that game. No, that was actually oh ridiculous. If, if you paid attention to that blue fox in the last three stocks of that uh, game five, uh, it was a master course yeah. in, in, in doubles fox play. That was really sick. Oh boy. All right, so we have one more of our top eight teams confirmed with Flex and Zealot making it in. All right. Slaying the, the heroes of SoCal. Vavez and Nut going to be fighting in the loser's bracket. No, that was losers. Well, I think. Yeah. I think that was losers. Well, shoot. Yeah. Thank you. That was a loser's top eight qualifier. We will remember the SoCal team of Nut and Vavez, but that's going to be it for them. Yeah.